when we're referring to the kind of study of speed, Virilio will use the word dromology or dromocratic. In one section, he talks about a dr- we don't have a democratic society. We have a dromocratic society. We have a kind of society which is determined not by the people, but by speed. And so dromology is the study of speed. And the word comes from dromos in Greek. Uh, I think some, sometimes these words are important to understand because it's not just speed. It's not just the thing moving. It's also what it's moving through. So, you know, race, track, course, path. Like race and running are just the object which is moving through something. But race, track, course, and path all suggest something that it's moving through, a kind of architecture or, a, or, or an infrastructure of movement. So we're not just talking. So whenever we're thinking about the study of speed, we're not just talking about the simple movement of a body. We're always also thinking about the world the body is in if we have that schema and that development of like mass uh, movement of like, you know, metabolic movements running, for example, to trains, to information technology, the more you go from like running, like in a hunter gatherer society, it's all just about like how, you know, how good, how good the, the, the living creature is at moving. It's kind of really important. You get into, you get into the later societies it's more about infrastructure. So it's more architectural. It's not like the object moving freely th- through the world in the capacity that he is able to move. It's more about like what's the already given kind of infrastructure and architecture, which is already there and kind of guides that movement.